This video shows you how you can reset any app on a Fire TV device. Now it might be that a particular app is giving you problems and uh, you don't want to have to reinstall it, although that is probably the uh, one of the best ways of fixing a problem with an app is to uninstall it or reinstall it. But this video shows you a quick way of resetting any app back to factory settings before you decide to uninstall and reinstall. At the end of the video, I will also show you how to uninstall and reinstall an app in case this doesn't work. So what you need to do is, for example, in this video, say for instance, BBC iPlayer isn't working. So don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things will help us make more great videos for you. I go across to the settings cog just over there on the right, Go down and across to applications there, once you're at applications, middle button, and then go down to manage installed applications. Once you've highlighted that, again, middle button. Okay, go down and find the app that's causing you problems. So in my case, like I say, it's the BBC iPlayer. So highlight it, middle button, and then go down to false stop, middle button, and then go down to clear data, middle button, middle button again, and then go down to clear cache, middle button, okay, and then what we do is we just go back into launch application up there, or we can press the house button on the remote control, the home button, and then find the app that we're having trouble with, and then go into it. And then hopefully this would be reset back to factory settings, it would sign us out of, there you go, so it signed me out, I'm gonna to have to sign in again. But if this didn't work for any reason, then what we could do is we can uninstall it. So again, same process, let's press the home button on the remote control, go across to the settings cog there, down to applications, middle button, then go down to manage installed applications, middle button, and then find our app, down there, so there you go, BBC iPlayer, again, middle button, and then go down to uninstall. Of course, you can press the uh, the play pause button to uninstall, but if you haven't got that option there, then go to uninstall there, and again, middle button on the remote control, and middle button again to uninstall. Now, I'd always say at this point, the best thing to do is to restart your Fire Stick, and to do that, all you need to do is press and hold the play pause button and the middle button on the remote control. But what I would say first is press the home button on the remote control to take you back to the main screen because you don't want to press and hold the play pause button and uninstall an app. So once you've done that, like I say, press and hold both the play pause button and the button in the center of the remote, in the center of the circle, hold them down together until you see a message saying that your Fire TV device is powering off, then let go, let it restart, okay, and then when you're back to this screen here, go across to the magnifying glass, go down to search, middle button, and then search for the app that you uninstalled. As you're typing it, if it's still available on the, uh, on, on the Amazon store, then you will see it appear below, like mine has BBC iPlayer, so I've highlighted it, middle button on the remote, select it from um, the, the, the list of apps there, middle button, middle button again to start downloading, and there you go, as you can see, it's now downloading. Now this bit might take a bit of time, it really does depend on the speed of your internet connection. Once it's downloaded and installed, it will uh, downloading will go to open, or it might go to installing and then, then open, but in any case, once you see it open, press the middle button on the remote control, and uh, the app will then open and you can obviously reset it up again from scratch. So there you go, a great little guide for you. And don't forget, whilst you're here, check out my other videos on my YouTube channel. I've got thousands of other videos covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully, you're gonna find something to educate you, entertain you, and maybe even amuse you. 
I hope you liked this video and if you did, hit that like button. If you think your friends, your family or your work colleagues might like it, then don't forget to share this on your social media timelines. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you find out about all my latest videos the second they're released. Hit that subscribe button, then hit the bell, then hit all. You can also find me on Twitter at CWTech and also find my website at cwtech.co.uk. Liking, sharing and subscribing really helps support this channel. Thank you very much.